All right, so here we are at the OpenStack Summit in Barcelona. And um, can you go ahead and introduce yourself and tell us what you do? I am Kendall Nelson. I just started at the foundation in August, actually, and I am an upstream developer advocate. Awesome. So you mentioned upstream in your title. What does that mean in a community like OpenStack? Upstream is really important because it's where all of the code is. Everything that's not proprietary to a certain company is worked on upstream. And so my job is to create um, like education and bring more people in and help them get started working um, upstream. So Upstream University is a, a event that we had going on yesterday and the day before, the first two days kind of before the summit really got kicked off. And that was really cool to see all the new people coming in. There was a really good mix of people from the U.S. and outside. Uh, we had like 60 people, and we hope to keep improving it, me and uh, Ildiko Fenska. So, yeah. Awesome. And so um, you, you mentioned Upstream University as mm -hmm. attached to the summit. I think we've done it a few cycles now. Yeah. So what is something, if folks can't attend the summit or after the summit, if they do want to get involved, what's the best way to get involved in the community and start contributing? Um, the way I did it, I, I started in Cinder and then eventually moved into the li libraries in, in between Nova and Cinder, the OS brick. And so that, uh, uh, how I got started into that was mostly doing code reviews and attending the weekly meetings for Cinder. They're really easy, and even if you don't say anything for the first year, you're looking at the code. It's, it's definitely a good way to get involved r right away before the summits happen and larger events. Awesome, and if yeah. you so say someone can't contribute code, is there another way that they can contribute that is would impact the um, contributions in a positive way as well? Definitely, besides code, there's obviously documentation is extremely important because not all of us can just walk up and understand what Python is right away. So that's, that's a, a really helpful way. And there are you know, user groups and working groups that all definitely need a lot of attention and more people too. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. I hope yeah. maybe I'll start contributing soon in the meantime. Yeah. <laughs> and, Super uh, easy. Yeah. Have a great week at the summit. Will do. Thank you.